Hey there guys, Prince Marquez and in this video I'll show you a simple way how you can easily integrate Monday.com with Twilio and how you can actually do it. So the first way and what I believe is the best way how you can integrate Monday.com with Twilio is to scroll down below to the description of this video and click on the link. When you're going to do it, you'll get right here to Make.com. Make.com is an amazing company that's going to help you integrate various applications and you can sign with the Gmail, Facebook, email uh, completely for free and then you're going to click on Scenarios. Here you want to go to the top right, create new, create new scenario, then click plus here and add a search and let's say I'm going to add it Monday or Twilio first. So you can have Twilio verify, autopilot or Twilio and let's say a message. So let's say when I'm going to create a call or get a call, delete a call, recording, trigger when new recording is added. So you can choose what needs to happen when the new message is created, let's say. You're going to choose the Twilio account here. Then you would add another module. And here I'm going to add Monday. So here I can have the get items column value, uh, add a column to board, get a team, create an item. So let's say I'm going to create an item. So let's say when I'm going to have a new message in Twilio, then I'm going to have a new item in Monday.com. You can make it vice versa. Also, you can contact Make.com customer service, and they're really helpful because they're going to help you with uh, integrating whatever app you have, whatever app you're using. So that's something you can do, and that's really effective. And how to connect Monday.com account? So you would come here, Monday.com, you would click add here, and then you're going to have the epic here. So you're going to go to bottom left of Monday.com, under archive you're going to have admin, then you're going to have epi, and you're going to copy the code here. Then you go back and paste the epi key, save. And then you would add an item name, so let's say message ID is going to be item name, and also from BAM, and you got it. Then board ID. group ID and that's pretty much it right so you can test it out to see if it actually works you can you can pick it play around it to make it really perfect for you and that's pretty much it how we do it so thank you very much guys for watching if you can have any questions uh, ask me down in the comments also definitely you can easily save it on the bottom you can run it once schedule the settings go to templates and you can find plenty of templates that you can use like let's say for Monday if you're using Monday.com they get a lot of templates that are really useful and I would recommend heavily to use them too. So thank you very much and have a great day and goodbye guys. See ya.